Well, the fact is China's done a better job of that than any country in the history of the world. China has lifted 728 million people out of poverty by international standards. It's an ambitious goal, but we shouldn't set small goals. We should set big goals, especially if you're a country as big and powerful and inclusive as China. You know, so I, I'm at the OECD, I'm in charge of our role in helping to implement the sustainable development goals established last September by the United Nations. And one of those goals, the ultimate goal there really, is to lift 800 million people worldwide out of extreme poverty. And that is, again, an ambitious goal, like the, like the goal here in China of the five-year plan, to do it in a shorter period to get 70 million people out. China has lifted 728 million people out of poverty by international standards. The whole of the rest of the world has only lifted 152 million, right? Therefore, the um, contribution to human well-being made by Deng Xiaoping is you know, un unequaled, in my opinion. I, I was really deeply moved. It, you might even hear my voice slightly waver, because the first time I went to Shanghai and I saw the great, a big portrait of Deng Xiaoping um, in the municipal hall there, um, and I was so moved because I knew he'd been there, uh, because I knew what, not merely what a great uh, theorist and um, leader of China was, but what an enormous contribution he'd made to human well-being, and that sums up my view about him. I've seen the changes, uh, both as a frequent visitor, but also my many friends in China. I've seen how their lives have improved. I talk a lot of for to foreign audiences about what's happening in China. Uh, not only has China done a really amazing job of lifting people out of poverty, but um, China still faces one of the biggest challenges in history, with 20 million people every year moving to the cities.